Welcome back. Well, the future is here. This weekend, you can learn about how technology is changing our lives. It's a new exhibit opening up this weekend at the Orlando Science Center. And this morning, we're joined by the exhibit's creator. This is HP Newquist, and he is brilliant when it comes to artificial intelligence. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for I having me. I really set you up there. <laughs> <laughs> I hope I can live up to it. You will. I know you will, because this is a topic that a lot of people are unsure about. Many people find it to to be exciting. Some people find artificial intelligence to be frightening. True. Obviously, you're on the exciting part of the spectrum. And it can also be scary. Sure. I mean, I think people uh, think of artificial intelligence as the Terminator and robots from the future coming back to control us. But the reality is that AI is something we use every day, whether you're using Siri or Alexa or Google Maps or Amazon recommendations, that's all artificial intelligence. So when people hear, you know, corporations talk about, oh, you know, we're, we're going to get rid of so many workers because we have all these computers who can do these jobs now, I think that's the part that scares people probably the most. It does, but any new technology has always been met with fear of, of lost jobs. But you're going to need people who are going to have to program those computers. You're going to have to have them maintain the computers. You're going to have all kinds of new jobs that open up. And AI will take over a lot of the kind of menial, simple tasks right now because AI is not that smart. It does some things incredibly well, but it doesn't know a lot of things. It's, each AI can do one particular thing, but no AI is even as smart as a five-year-old. What do you anticipate for the future? I think that's the one thing that everybody is maybe most interested in is what's, this is great, but what's next? What's next is, is depends on who's running the show. Um, computers are only as good as the people that program them and control them. So if you've got people with ill intent, then AI could be problematic. If you've got people who use it for you know, making your life easier, making your day-to-day -day job better, then that's a good thing for AI. Do you anticipate someday that we will be in all, you know, cars that are auto self fully automated that will be flying through the air, sort of like the Jetsons were doing many moons ago? You no, know, if you'd asked me that <laughs> five years ago, I would have said no. And now I don't think we're that far away. Uh, maybe not flying through the air, but autonomous vehicles, self-driving cars. Um, really do work quite well and in many cases drive better than people do. Well, that's a good point. And drones are already dropping off our packages yes, in some are. places too, which is just wild. Let's talk about the exhibit because what it, what it is is very interactive and Correct. it's great for all ages from what I understand. It is. We've, we want to show how AI is, is real and relevant to people. So not only will they come in and learn about how their own brains and minds work, but they'll see how we program machines to do the things that humans do. So you'll see what a self-driving car sees. Uh, you'll be able to interact with uh, an AI that tries to get your emotions and your age. Interesting. Uh, you'll also see how AI uses facial mapping to identify you and separate you from somebody else. So it starts this weekend, it right? It does. It opens on Saturday. And then how long does it go for? It goes until January 5th. Oh, wow. So it's going to be here for a while. It'll That's be here great. three months. Don't wait till the Don't last wait. minute. Don't wait. Yes, that's a good point. And RM David Martin is actually going to be out there next week. So he'll be walking through the exhibit and trying out some of the, the interactive exhibits so that you at home will be able to see. So how Correct. long will you be in town? I'm here through the weekend. Fabulous. Well, we're so glad you're here. And thank you for bringing in here. Oh, thank you for having and me. And we appreciate you coming in to see us this morning. Thanks thank you, a lot. HP Newquest, for being here this morning.